The aim of our experiment is preparation of permanent mount of allium sepha to study different stages of mitosis using acetocarmine and fulgen staining technique. We require onion root tips, acetocarmine, 45% glacial acetic acid, slides, cover slips, forceps, blade and microscope. The very first step is remove the old roots from the base of the onion and fix it on a beaker containing tap water using toothpicks like you see here. Make sure the base of the bulb touches the water level. Now keep this in safe place for a couple of days once the root have grown about 1 to 2 cm. When root becomes 1 to 2 cm in length, cut the roots and downgrade to water. Stain them in acetocarmine for 40 minutes. Take out one root on a slide and with the help of surgical blade, cut the darkly stained root tip for further processing. Add a drop of 40% acetic acid, put a cover slip and make a squash. Figure 1 shows fulgen stained at low magnification and figure 2 shows acetocarmine stained at high magnification. This is the very first stage of mitosis that is prophase. In this stage, we can see chromatin begin to condense and chromosomes appear as thin threads. Centrioles move to each pole of the cell. Spindle apparatus is assembled. Nuclear envelope begins to dissolve and nucleolite disappear. Also, chromosomes appear distinct at the end of prophase. Prophase is followed by metaphase. In metaphase, chromosomes align themselves at equatorial plate. Chromosomes become attached to the microtubules. Microtubules begin to pull each chromosome toward the center of the cell. Metaphase plate is the imaginary plane through the center of the cell where the chromosomes align. The stage after metaphase is anaphase. In anaphase, microtubules pull apart the kinetochores of sister chromatids towards the pole. The sister chromatids of the chromosomes move towards opposite poles. Chromosomes assume various shapes that is V-shaped in metacentric, J-shaped in submetacentric and road-shaped in telocentric. Last stage of mitosis is telophase. In telophase, spindle apparatus dissembles. Nuclear envelope forms around each set of sister chromatids. Chromosomes begin to uncoil. Nucleolus reappears in each new nucleus.